Nicely poised for this final. The referee in the middle for this one is Turban Tetsensing of Mongolia. Gold medal contest in these world championships. What a task then for the world number one, Shireen Bukli, to be going up against the current world champion, Sonoda Natsumi. This is what I was talking about earlier on. She's strolling out, and they look as though they're just taking a walk in the park. Her and the coach, just having a chat, last couple of words. And it's, it's almost as though she's not quite sure where she's going until the coach says, hey, um, we're down these steps, we're, we're down here. Oh, yeah? Is this, is this where we're going? No, she, you know how some people have their game face on? You know, they're screwing up and contorting, and you see their teeth, you see their tonsils. They're slapping their faces. Yeah, yeah. The coach is slapping her. But she's just like out for a walk. Yeah, we did say it earlier, it should be a great match, this. Two uh, very on form athletes. She even had a little smile before she went on to the, to the coach. It's all, it appears to be, you know, within her grasp, all in the day's work. Right, we're on the way, Neil. Well, fighting for her third world title here at Sonoda. But uh, I tell you now, Bookley is going to come out here and try and ruin the day. Saw it earlier, oh, she dropped into the hold. Oh my goodness, what a mistake that was. Uh, now she's going to readjust the balance. Can she do it? Just to take that uh, leg out. I think she'll get it out. It's out, it's out. And uh, Bookley just managing to pull it back in. Is the referee going to allow this to carry on? Yes. Yep. That's an old side coming, is it? Yet. Not quite. This next readjustment will be it. On to the head. And she's holding Bunkley down. Oh, Bunkley's out. <laughs> If you're going to get out, out you better get out when you've got some power. power. The, only the only reason she's out of that is in the first minute. You come, come in, in, at the back end of the contest, you won't have the power, have the power to do that. Do you know, you know what? There's nothing, nothing worse than looking up at those likes up there and, uh, and, uh, and you think, I, I'm in trouble here. But no, she did well to get out of that. What a mistake that was from Bunkley. And she tries the uh, Tom and Aggie there again, uh, Sonoda. Too early for me uh, with, with, a, with a fighter like Bootley to be trying those. She's going to block those, you know, every day of the week. You need to set something else up. You have to have some movement there. And Bootley's just had a little bit too strong. We saw that with her getting out of the Osai Komi on two occasions there. She got held and was still out. Doesn't, Doesn't like, like that arm round the back, does she, uh, Sonoda? Sonoda? She knows, she knows that the uh, Uki Goshi Ogoshi is going to come. And she's had massive success with that earlier on. Talking, talking about Bookley. Sticky foot, foot. as she, she was up. Yeah, yeah going to be in trouble with that if she keeps on doing it. There was too much of a delay there. Yeah, too much of a delay. Good attempt there from the Japanese coach. <laughs> he fans you from Missouri. Yeah. yeah. Too much, Too much of a delay, delay. you can see, see that. They're going to have a look oh, uh, at that. Was it all one? <laughs> yeah. And I'm glad that they. The landing is one thing. The landing was okay. It was the, yeah, it was the technique. Yeah, it was too, too much. Yeah. Nervous times for. Both, Both sets, sets of fans. fans. Nice little Kosoto, Kosoto there. Yeah. The great yeah. thing, yeah, the great yeah. thing, isn't it, about the uh, Japanese is just the use of the feet. They, you know, they're just so used to using the feet and the hands together to get direction, changing of direction as well. That was one. Oh, yeah. and she gets the impulse. Oh, dear me. Third world title there, and she just looked as if she was uh, having a little amble in the park. Look at the face, did just nothing. Can you go down and just tell him that she's just won her third world title there? And beat the world number one, through the world number one for everybody, to take a third world title. Wow, wow. that was uh, truly a great performance there from Sonoda. 
and uh, I tell you now, if you if you just saw her walking off there and you didn't know it was the final of the World Championships, is she going to crack a smile? Yeah. Oh, now she does. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> now she does. Very cool, calm, and collected. Absolutely excellent stuff there. She was the defending world champion. That's her third world title. Well, that's bad news for Koga, I'm afraid. Because even though Koga picked up a bronze a medal, a third gold medal at a world championships. This time, I mean, you can see clearly there that there is no delay on this one. It's totally different to the other one when she went down. It was all one movement, all one movement there. And uh, just takes her onto her back. And it's the control with the hands as well. Look at the control with the hands. And uh, it's like you said, it's uh, Tom and Aggie, but uh, it's almost like a Sumagashi as well. And uh, she just scoops them up. Yeah, because with the second, it's it's good at her feet are like climbing up there. You know, we, we also, we talk about body language, you know, and for me, I don't think she had any doubt, no doubt whatsoever that she was going to retain her world title. She, it was just a matter of time. Did well to get out of the hold down, Bookley. Twice. Yeah. And like, as you said, it's, it's very rare that you get out of a hold and it's the Japanese women doing the holding. They're so, so clinical. clinical.